Hello, my sweet and beautiful friends. I hope everyone is doing wonderful. Uh, spring is in the air and we are ready for, uh, well, we're getting ready for spring. I still have uh, Valentine's here and um, I thought it would look so beautiful. It was, so it hurt so much to take it off, but I'm ready to um, try and top that off with spring. I did not go out and buy a lot. So I am using a lot of the stuff that I used last year. I just tried to kind of change it around and, and see how it goes. I did get this one a few months ago, this, this um, table runner, and I loved it. It is so pretty. It is very neutral, and it just goes with just about anything. It is a very shabby chic-ish, and I believe it's going to look great with my decor for this spring. Well, I began by adding my two beautiful little Ray Dunn a mug, pink mugs that I love so much. And I used them last year and I'm using them again this year. And then here in this little cute uh, stand, I am adding another Ray Dunn little basket that I really like. And I added a little uh, pink flower arrangement. And I think it looks really cute. I also have the matching pair here, the little bunny that's inside an eggshell. I think it looks really cute here. I used it and I'm using it again. All right, here I am uh, using my trusty old two-tier tray that I love. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add a few little things that I've already had. I also added uh, my sugar container there in the back and then uh, my cute little bunny that I've already had as well up here. And then I've used my other um, sugar container, which this one uh, doesn't have anything in it, but it matches this beautiful little uh, creamer that um, I, it just goes so pretty here. I really like how everything looks and I added another little flower arrangement in it. Okay, here in the bottom of the tray, I've added another little bunny. I've added uh, a sign that I've already had last year, and I love this sign because it says it's not about the bunny, it's about the lamb, and I really like that, and I think it looks great here. Here I am adding my trusty old chalkboard, and this time I decided to get um, a little poster board that I glued. Well, I didn't glue it, I just put some tape on it. And then I had this one last year too, and I just decided to um, get a little command hook and just, um, hold, I guess, tape it on to the chalkboard so it wouldn't fall off. Well, that's pretty much all that I did to my coffee bar for the spring. Here's uh, a look at my Valentine's coffee bar, and here is my spring coffee bar. It looked pretty bare back here where my bunny is, so I decided to add a little tiny candle that I had, and I still have my marshmallows there. <laughs> we haven't finished them, and um, I'm just gonna leave them there for now. Okay, now we're uh, in the dining room area. I have a little, uh, you could say it's like a buffet little table that I have. It's the table that I had in my living room before I got my little chimney and I decided to um, 
make it also very springy and shabby chicish. I also got this uh, tablecloth and I believe that it looks very pretty. It matches the one, the table runner that I have in my coffee bar. Uh, the other change that I did was my light fixture. As you can see, it used to be a darker color, like a brown, and um, now it's white, and I think it looks so much better. Here I also had these glass candle holders, and I decided to paint them white. I think they look so much better. And then I added some greenery because I think it looked a little bare here. I also made that a little one in the middle. I have a tutorial that I will go ahead and link below. And this is how it turned out at the end, my little buffet table. I have little, this little cute cake stand and I had it over here in the buffet table, but I decided to add a candle and then put it over here on my table. So I think it looks so much better over here with my little salt and pepper piggies. And then I just have uh, this picture that I got at a Goodwill in uh, Tucson, I believe, with my daughter when she used to live there. And then of course, here's my china cabinet. I recently painted that and I will have uh, the video link below as well. And inside I still have just my Ray done. I haven't done anything to this poor china cabinet. I just added a few tulips to make it look a little more festive. And then I added some flowers on top, like a little bouquet of flowers. And this is it. I mean, this is my little spring dining room. What do you think? Okay, and we are now in my living room. Uh, right here in my chimney, I've added a few little touches of spring and Easter. I've had this bunny already. Also, I also had this happy Easter sign that I've used last year in my living room. I also have another bunny over here with a candle. And then I got this little white house. Um, I got a few of them at Target and I added some lamb's ear to it. And then here in my garland, I've already had this garland here for um, winter and I just added a few little flowers to it to just make it look very springy. Here I added my wreath, my beautiful wreath that I got. Um, I think I got it in Phoenix and my daughter shipped it to me. And this here, my little um, arrangement that I've had here for a while, I added some pink flowers and then I added my beautiful and favorite um, bunny pillow cover. On this side, I've added all the flowers that I had on my uh, coffee bar last year, and I believe that they look so pretty here. I have here another uh, Target little white house. In this metal house, I've had it for a few years, and it has um, all, it holds all my remote controls. And in the back, I have a little basket with my puppy's toys. And that's pretty much it. Okay, now we're in my kitchen and I just added a, a cute little wreath that I added some uh, pink flowers to it. It's in the door of my pantry. And then I, I made this last year in one of my videos is it has the tutorial if you would like to see it i will also link it below and then here i just added all my utensils my pink utensils that i love and i just put a little flower pot here and uh, i believe that's it i am done i mean i didn't really do much to it but i think that it made a big difference i think that it looks very very pretty and it just I don't know when when you decorate your home for every season it just oh i don't know i can't explain it i'm sure a lot of you understand what i'm talking about 
<laughs> but thank you so much i want to thank all of you for um watching this video for being part of my youtube channel thank you for subscribing and i'm also want to give you another look at my coffee bar usually that's um, my most popular videos on youtube the ones with my uh, coffee bar let me know what you think about my new uh, spring coffee bar Well, I just want to say goodbye to everyone and always remember to try something new every day. Bye-bye.